again. Well, how about that cliffhanger? Well, it wouldn't really be fair to leave you in the lurch to find out whether I'm about to bite the dust or not. So I suppose we ought to find out together, shall we? <sighs> Here we go. Come on, you. It would appear not. <laughs> right, let's get some light on this situation before we get any more spawning monstrosities. Oh, God, there's more noise. Oh, that's alright. Most of that's cows. Okay, I can't see anything coming that way. That's a bit of a dark corner. Oh, don't scare me like that, monsters. Right. Looks like that goes around the corner. Bit of water. And the tunnel continues, but hopefully the water should keep them at bay. Right, the reason I said putting the torches on one side of the tunnel is so as you go down, you've always got them on your right. And as you're heading for home, they're always on your left. And as long as you keep them on your left, you know you're heading for home. Mm, nastiness. Didn't even see that. Never mind. Have a look around here while we chase them. Right, oh, an arrow. And another bone. Deep joy. Right, well, we've lit up a bit of an area. This stops little herberts from spawning. As long as we get above a certain light level, they can't spawn. Now for, oh, another little hole. Well, it goes into where we would have been. Right, the reason we've come down here totally unarmoured and everything was just to grab a few resources. Oh, them cows worry me. I can hear footsteps and stuff, and that is not good. Right, so, a bit more coal. It's pointless having iron if we can't smelt it. Well, we could use our charcoal. We can now keep an eye out because you don't really want to come down into caves about any armor at all. It's uh, it's a bit like asking for disaster, but it's okay because I'm a professional and I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Lots. Oops, need to fill in that hole. Any more iron about? We've only got five pieces so far. I'd like a few more. Keep an eye. Always keep an eye upwards in tunnels. Because the last thing you want is a creeper dropping on your bonds. Keep hearing footsteps. Not good, not good. Hello, who we got here? Oh good, it's a big old dumb zombie. Right, if you hit them on a downward stroke, you see them stars? That means you've got a critical hit. So just keep jumping, clicking that button, and here we go. I think I see a skeleton around that corner as well. Oh, I did. There does seem to be more than a few of them around here. Oh, good. A creeper! Yee! Get ready to run away. Ah, oh, we got away lucky. As I said, do have a tendency to go bang the little rat bags. More iron down here, and again more noise of bones. But I must admit, I have come around to the idea. This thing just actually puts noises in just to freak the crap out of you. Right, let's get a bit more iron. Keep an eye. A little nasty is coming my way. there. And another one there. And another one there. Oh my god, I'm spot for choice. Let's take this one, shall we? Oh, we have a cavern. And more tunnel entrances. <sighs> I do not want to go too deep. Looking for bits and pieces at the moment. Any armor on, and chances are neither will you have. And I don't really fancy getting munched. Oh, up here. Let's 
Certain minerals appear at certain levels. The deeper you go, the better they get. Dead end. Okay. No, I didn't. Not a lot of luck then. Okay, let's come back down here. I could definitely do a bit more iron. Oh, perhaps I missed that bit. Never dig directly beneath yourself, because you could drop into something nasty. Probably lava. Highly recommended against if you don't fancy doing some dying. Oh, here we go. There doesn't be an awful lot of skeletons around here. I don't know why. Oh, little rat. Come here. I'm not having any of your rubbish. I don't know why we've got so many skeletons here. Another one. Yeah, good night. You coming after me, are you? Oh, you're there. Hello. Well, don't leave just when we're getting friendly. Just getting acquainted as well. Alright, there's a bit of combat for you. Let's head up with our minerals and see what we can do with them, shall we? Got a bit more coal on the way. Now, you can actually make armour out of leather. Better than nothing, but only barely. But as we haven't really been killing our cows yet, we probably haven't got much. I've got a bit more because I've sort of been killing our animals. Yet once you've farmed your animals and you've got them in a pen, anything else of the same species is fair game. Feel free to go psycho on it. So right now, chickens and cows are history if I come across them. And probably sheep because they're a pain in the butt, I don't like them. Right, where are we? Um, I thought that's where I was going there. Oh yes, yeah, down there for another day. But we're heading up. Oh, it's night time. That's probably why all these skeletons are appearing. All right, night time when the big nasties appear, and we're probably going to bump into something. No, it looks quite peaceful. Don't be fooled though. I'm sure creepers are out and out looking for me. All right. Quick dash home. Whew, safety of our abode. Right, I'm not sure how much longer I've got on this video, but it shouldn't be much. But we're going to quickly smelt up that iron ore. Iron ore at the top, coal on the bottom. And here we go. This is the same with gold. Uh, diamonds come already done. Lapis comes already done. Uh, what else can you smelt? I don't think anything else you can smelt, really, for the minute. Unless you've got another mod with some more ores in it. Obsidian comes in block form. As long as you've got a diamond pickaxe, that is. So, there we go. Iron. Right, we're looking at making armour. Let's have a look. Six, seven, eight. Um, what have we got? Nine. I can get a chest plate out of this. I'll stick with my stone sword for the minute and get a chest plate. I'd rather have a bit of protection than better minerals. Right, also while I'm talking about it, I keep plugging Paul Sorres, but I haven't been plugging Yogcast. Uh, they are brilliant. Please check them out. They are hilarious. I highly recommend them. Uh, Blue Exophos or something other. And uh, honestly, you, you might not learn as fast, but you'll have a lot more fun trying. Uh, I think everybody in the world needs a Simon. He is, he cracks me up, he really does. Okay, come on, one more, and uh, we're ready for crafting our first piece of armour. And hopefully the video will last long enough to show it. Let's do it. Right. I enter our crafting table. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One iron chest. 